So check this out. So I'm gonna have Sid in full guard. Right, and then from here, right, you guys know, most of you guys know just a regular, regular old arm bar. And this kind of is just like the guard retention drill we were doing where I have to bring my knee down, where I have to suck my knee down, right? So I'm just gonna throw simple old arm bar, right? He's just gonna keep his arms super traditional style. He doesn't really know that defense. I threw it on him too fast. And he's gonna pull his, the arm that I'd be arm barring out. So you're gonna pull that arm out. I'm gonna just snatch up his tricep here. I'm gonna pull my knee down to the mat and then I'm gonna swing my other leg all the way over his head. It's like a John Jock style arm bar right here. And from there I just, I got him in pretty tight, right? So it's not an arm bar that happens all the time, but I noticed it would be pretty good in MMA. The reason why is because usually in MMA, the guy doesn't have this defense going on. Usually the person just swings an arm bar and they just caught, you know, they pull their arm out. And if I can swing my leg back around and they leave that other guy hanging, I can go back and attack it, right? So full guard, right? Super simple. I just, maybe I push the arm across, deep hook, shoot the arm under the leg, keep that leg up high, throw my arm bar, flexing my feet and from here I'm trying to extend him but he's crunching me down right so once he pulls that arm out now I just have to stick with it a lot of times too if the guy starts to push down and get his weight down that leg keeps him away and I just have to throw that leg up and then I get to finish all right so do it one more time a little bit of speed right there all right let's give it a try one two three